when I was a kid, I don't come from a theatrical family at all, or like have any interest. And my, my mum and dad, because uh, I had an interest, would take me to the theatre. And one of the first things I went and saw was A Midsummer Night's Dream at the National Theatre. And Tim was playing Bottom. And it was all set in mud, and there was a contortionist playing Puck, this woman. Um, and when, when the ears came onto Bottom, this contortionist got up on Tim's, ear, uh, Tim's shoulders, and her feet oh, wow. were the ears. And I remember afterwards, we went on a tour behind, and that is when, when I got sold on, like, on, on genuinely on the magic of it. So we heard you say that it's fantastic because it was one of the most uncomfortable experiences <laughs> I've ever had in my life. Not only were you performing in the best designed wet fart you'd ever seen in your life. <laughs> a swamp, basically, wasn't it? But I had a French-Canadian contortionist on my back when I was trying to do comedy, Shakespeare comedy. And it felt like hell. And one, one day, I've got to tell you this story, but one day somebody came in, because I had to test, it was in a massive pile of water. So, so, so I'm so pleased, Eddie, that you, that you liked it. Because <laughs> so, somebody came in and said, you've not heard the latest. Someone's done a poo in the mud. Oh my God. Right? <laughs> and I said, what are you talking about? Someone's done a poo in the mud. I said, I'm lying in that before the audience come in. They said, well, you know, the, the, we have to test it. Someone's done a shit in the mud. <laughs> I said, this is outrageous. And I went, I went to the stage doorkeeper at the National Theatre, who'd been there for years, wonderful woman. I said, you're never going to guess what I've just heard. You know the fairies were all diving around in the mud. <laughs> Someone's done a poo in it. She said, oh, that doesn't surprise me. We've had a phantom shit at the Royal National Theatre for years. <laughs> oh, my God. I said, can you run that by me again? A phantom shitter at the Royal <laughs> National... <laughs> and I, now, think of all the people who've worked at the National... Who is the phantom? Is he still there? And who started it? I mean, there's a pantheon of the most brilliant <laughs> classical actors in the world. And someone was <laughs> dropping a log in there. <laughs> So, we're talking about the classics here, but, you know, talk about a spoiler. So, Eddie, when you say that you like that, thank you, mate.